Happy Tuesday, everybody. First of all, I would like to remind everybody to get out and vote. I voted this morning on my way to work. I hope you can find the chance to uh, use your right that we have as an American and get out there and vote. And today, I thought I would talk to you about gnomes. You can see a whole tree of gnomes behind me and the whole front end of our store is full of gnomes. They have continued to be a trend for a few years now. And I wanted to give you a few ideas for things to do with your gnomes if you're like, oh man, I have so many, I don't know what to do with them, or that one is so cute, but I don't know where I would put it. So besides your traditional, sit it on a shelf, sit it on your mantle, sit it above your cupboard, here are a few other ideas. First, throw them in your Christmas tree, or put your own little Christmas tree up that is just gnomes. If you like them that much, there's a cool way to display them. The lights pop through them, you can stick them underneath in between the branches you can have them hanging onto branches you can have them peeking underneath or behind things so that's a fun way to use them but also a lot of the gnomes that we sell or that you might have have wires in the hat so here's an example of a cute little guy and his hat is wired and the original intention of that is you know you can make his hat move different directions but the other cool thing is that it makes it a little hanger or a hook that you can now hook it on other things so think about maybe hanging one on each side of your curtain rod in your living room or maybe off of the edge of a picture or somewhere in your house that might use a little pizzazz but now again you have this built-in hook that you can put it somewhere you can wrap it around a doorknob this one's got a little jingle bell you can hear when someone enters the door so that's a fun way to use them this is another version um, it is a wine bottle topper so you can put the wine bottle underneath he has a hole that's meant to do that but if you like that idea but you don't have a gnome like that again if it's wired loop that around and you can loop it around the end of a wine bottle give it as a gift or display it in your house so use those wires to your advantage another cool place to put them is on the inside of a wreath so I have a cute little guy here. He's called our cousin Eddie Gnome. So maybe he sits inside of your wreath that's on your front door or in your home somewhere as another option. So be creative. Don't be afraid to show off your gnomes. If you love them, that's great. Stop by and check out our selection here. We have literally hundreds of them in pretty much every color and shape. We even have some penguins, some nutcrackers, some moose. We have some blues and whites and grays and reds and blacks and everything in between. So stop by and check them out. Get inspired for the holidays. We have all of our decor out and we would love to see you. All right, everybody, as always, thank you so much for watching. Stay safe, go and vote, and happy Tuesday.